Black Super here, and I'm going to show you about Game Informer. I'm still collecting them, but once I start collecting them even more, I can show you guys around a little bit more. But let's get, let's get to the games. Informers. Whatever you the fuck you want to call them. What do you want? Yeah? Yeah, five minutes. <coughs> All right. Okay, that was my hand. Anyway. Alright. So, let's see. Here are all my game informers. Easily numbered. As you can see, easily numbered. Not a big stack of them, but I still keep enjoying them. And then, like, um, here, I can show you. Here, let me get them out. Oh, oh man. Ah, oh, fuck my hand. I hate this. Alright. Wait, wrong way to spread them. I want to spread them out. So where you can see the, um... So, yeah. These are all my game informers. A lot of them. See? As you can see, there's, there's a lot of game informers. Now, just let me tell you that dipping onto the, my first issue, it's a little bit... Yeah, I don't take care of my issues very well, but... Just dipping into this issue just, just blew my mind the very first time. And I love this ad right here. Nose power through. I love that. And now this picture is fucking awesome. Assassin's Creed Re Revenge, I think. And then these, these are just awesome. I, I I just love it. Especially this one with um. I believe it's Raymond Origins. Let me see. Yes, this is Raymond Origins. I do have the game, but it's still cool to look back on. It's still really cool to look back on. I mean, NFL, you got NFL, you got your Shadows of Damned. Ooh, you even got Sonic Generations in here. That's why I'm wearing this, to celebrate Sonic's birthday. And a Mario hat, which came with, hold on. Where is it? Aha, there you are. It came with this. As you can see, Mario Hat came with this. A little big, but yeah. I'm a Mario and Sonic fan. That's why you got Mario and Sonic at the Olympics. But yes, it's barely. Barely. It's, it's, they're really good games. Now my favorite is, my favorite game right here is Super Mario Kart. Yeah, this is how the game came. I'm st stupid, I know. Oh, yeah, no. Is that my favorite album? No, it isn't really my favorite album. My favorite albums are on Kids Bob and whatnot. How is there poop on the seat? But, yeah. And then that's my summer camp right there. But anyway, I, li I like this issue because I think Link is cool. Let me find where I put that. My dad would love this issue. Itchu. <laughs> Itchu. <laughs> it's weird. This one, I just think is fucking awesome. I mean, seriously, I mean, from front cover to back, these things are just absolute classic. I mean, all right, let me see. Which one is this? Um, 30, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. Okay. Now, I do have copies, copycats. About, I got copies. As you can see here, copies, except one has the 
the expiration notice and the other doesn't. This one's, they're basically in the same shape, but then, then you've got copies like this one, which also have expiration notice. This one also has an expiration notice, and it's a little bad around the edges. And then this one is a lot newer. And then you've got your your two game informers that look exactly alike with no expiration notices. Now the one I really like is the one the two the three I really like is this one. Waha! <laughs> I love that. And then I love uh, Grand Theft Auto. Woo! <laughs> I love that. And as I said, I like the link. That's just an absolute classic one. And then I just think this one, this is my newest one. It's really, really interesting. I mean, from front cover to back, all these are just plain old classic. And that's my story of Game Informer. Have a night. Bye-bye.